Are DevOps and site reliability engineers competitors or a tandem that perfectly complement each other? Let's find out and watch this video till the end to find out when you need DevOps or SRE. You're on the Jelvix channel, weekly videos in tech in five minutes. Don't forget to subscribe not to miss new videos. Well, SRE, which stands for Site Reliability Engineering, solves operationally scaling and reliability issues. SRE's focus is on system stability. The fundamental principles of SRE include creating CI or CD DevOps processes to automate infrastructure scaling, devoting at least 50% of the time to improving the system, not to routine tasks, creating a service level agreement, service level objectives, and service level indicators for your services, and measuring system performance against them, setting up an error budget to control the rate at which the changes are introduced into production, implementing in-depth monitoring to see latency, congestion, traffic, and errors, writing response scripts to address issues based on clear system-based alerts, and correcting any errors found. In turn, DevOps is a set of cultural principles, approaches, and tools that improve the ability of companies to build applications and services at high speed. Its main principles are similar to those of SRE, but its focus is much wider. There are five key pillars of DevOps, namely, no more silos, as the absence of cooperation and information flow between teams decrease performance. Failure is okay, as DevOps dictate learning from mistakes and not wasting resources on unreachable purpose. The change must be progressive, as changes are most efficient and less risky when they are tiny and regular. The more automation, the better, as DevOps concentrates on automation to provide upgrades faster and save hours of monotonous work. And metrics are crucial, as every change should be measured to see if it delivers the desired results. So how does SRE relate to DevOps? In fact, SRE and DevOps are not competitors, since SRE provides an approach to solving most DevOps problems. Now let's take a look at the way teams use SRE to implement DevOps principles and philosophy. So, DevOps encourages the adoption of automation tools, and SRE guarantees that every team member can access updated automation instruments and technologies. DevOps involves slow, incremental changes to ensure continuous improvement, and SRE supports this by letting teams perform small, frequent updates. DevOps ensures that different software development teams work harmoniously on a common goal, and SRE achieves this by sharing ownership of projects between teams. Aren't you wondering what are the differences between the job roles of SRE and DevOps? Okay. We'll explain based on how it works at Jelvix. Actually, they'll be best explained by the day-to-day -day tasks of the people working in those jobs. SRE usually includes such responsibilities as writing code and managing configurations for automation, monitoring software infrastructure, tracking and resolving tickets for fixing bugs, planning for software deployment with a fixed infrastructure using CI, CD, and ensuring the binaries and configurations are applicable for integration and deployment in different environments. In contrast, DevOps engineers at Jelvix typically focus on simplifying the development and deployment of software for the development team, using tools to automate build, test, and deploy software according to CI CD priorities, setting up, maintaining, and documenting infrastructure components, developing workflows to enable CI, CD projects, setting up and maintaining various virtual environments, and implementing and supporting cluster environments. By the way, we highly recommend you check the article where we describe in detail whether Agile and DevOps can get along. The link is in the description. Based on Jelvix experience, SRE teams are suitable for large technology corporations that handle billions of requests daily and prioritize the availability of their services. In turn, DevOps culture and cross-functional teams benefit any business operating in a highly competitive environment. So DevOps and SRE teams aren't all that different. Both help to bring development and operator teams together 
while sharing similar responsibilities with a focus on automation and reliability. And have you already determined which experts are needed for your team? This video was prepared by the Jelvix team. We help top brands worldwide to innovate and accelerate digital transformation. We share the latest news about tech trends and innovations weekly. So make sure to subscribe not to miss a single video. Also, share which topics we need to cover next on our channel. And don't forget to press the bell button. Bye for now.